Hey goofballs, and welcome to episode 241 of Animal Crossing New Horizons. In the last episode, we tried to catch the slippery sea pig to no avail. And in this episode, we are going to be looking for the slippery sea pig again, but hopefully this time to avail. Wait. Anyway, today's birthday is, uh... Lobo, but I don't have his card. Sorry, I had to think because I, I didn't have his card to remind me who it is. Anyway, let's start and get our IOI broadcast from Isabel. I know, I shouldn't be on top of these things, like what birthday it is, if even if I don't have the card, but... <sighs> That's just not how things work around here, I'm afraid. Oh yeah, in the last episode, we helped Galavar, which means we should get a uh, pirate item. Cool. I hope it's a cannon or a steering wheel. Hi. Good evening, everyone. How you doing, Isabel? Right now on Jack Town, it's 9.07 p.m. on Thursday, November 5th, 2020. November 5th. Hmm, there really isn't any news to speak of today. But... Hey, oh. did anyone else catch yesterday's cooking show? Isabel, did you literally just... Did you do that just to... To trick me. The spiced minestrone they featured looked so delicious. Fine, I'll wish you luck. I'm thinking about trying out the recipe myself. I'll tonight. wish you luck. Wish me luck. Ah, oh, I'll wish you oh, luck. Oh dear. Never. There I go again, prattling on about my personal TV habits. Sorry, folks. That's all for now. I hope you all enjoy the loveliest of lovely days. Oh, by the way, I am wearing my Animal Crossing official t shirt. Uh, here it is. Uh, yeah, it's really cool. It has Tom Nook, KK, Isabel, Reese and Cyrus. I, I honestly don't know why Reese and Cyrus. I mean, they played a big part in the last game, but in this game, their part is basically just a cameo. Anyway, we have something from Gullivar and something from Goose. Let's read the Gullivar first. I mean, not read it, because it's the same every time. But let's open the present. Anyway. Prezi. It is a pirate wall. Hmm. Cool. Coolio, you might say. Anyway, let's read the thing from Goose. I can just imagine Goose reading this to me now. Get pumped, Tim! I found this really awesome art thing when I was out on patrol the other night. I asked around and nobody claimed it, so I'm gifting it to you for all the awesome stuff you're always doing for us. Stay muscular, Goose. So, this could get us a real piece of art. Last time somebody sent me a piece of art, it was real. So this could get us a real piece of art. But it depends. Did Goose happen to find a real piece of art? It is a mystic statue. And it is a fake mystic statue. Um, I actually have one up here. And you see how it has that earring? I mean, it's fake. So I get a second one. Whatever, it's, it's still cool. Though. I'm actually really afraid to put up this pirate wall, because... Um, every time I put up a wall, it ends up, like, destroying the things on the wall by adding windows. But, the way I can get by this is by doing it upstairs, because upstairs already has windows, so it can't create windows. It, it just got rid of the windows, anyway. Anyway, this looks really cool. This looks, this looks epic. This looks really epic. Like, really epic. I like this. I don't think it's perfect for up here, but... You know what? I think I might put that in my... Um... Whatever you call it. My fancy room. Oh, by the way, uh, I found out something you can do with the ring The ring thing. You can, you can bend it. It's cool. 
I have the Ring Fit Adventure, but I haven't gotten around to playing that yet. So, so I don't know. I don't know. I don't know currently if that's part of the game. Probably is. I mean, why else would it do that? Anyway, I forgot I need to put up this wall. Because it would look really cool in my fancy room. I might have to rearrange so it looks like... So it doesn't look like I'm just, like, hanging stuff on the windows. Anyway. This is nice and all, but... Oh, I put it away, didn't I? You know what? I'll just go into this mode. Uh, right. Uh, not pockets. I want storage, and I'll put away. Not put away. I'll get out this pirate wall. Uh, that's the pirate wall, right? Ooh, look at the sea view. But the pirate wall fits better in here. Anyway, you know that still looks good with some of this stuff. Um. You know what, I don't why, know why I put these hats up here anyway. Anyway, uh... These things I might get rid of. Yeah, like this stuff. I, For some reason, I don't know why I put it up there. The shirt is the only thing that matters, because that was the shirt I came to Jack down on. Anyway, it still looks good, even with the... Um... New wallpaper, and it looks even better with the new wallpaper, actually. This is nice. Jack approved. Pirate wall. Ooh, I didn't mean to pick that up. What was it? What was it? Plant. I'm gonna plant it back down. Ooh, right. Is red here? Red is not here. I don't care. I care a little, but <laughs> he's came a lot lately, so I don't care. Nook shopping. KK Walt, I know I already have that. Because it's one of my faves. I say that about every song, but that's literally one of my faves. I have a lot of favorites. You can have those. You can have a lot of favorites. It's a thing. Anyway. Let's uh, go in here. See if there's anything cool. <gasps> there's absolutely nothing cool here. Check here. Just in case there might be anything really interesting. <sighs> Not really. Not really at all. Anyway. Let's go looking for that slippery sea bank. Oh, right. I, 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 I want to do my uh, daily chores first. Because when I don't do them first, I end up forgetting about them and rushing and doing them at the end. And it's not fun. It's not. It's not. Anyway, I always take two rounds over here because I... Uh, like, the message bottle was always over here, and I always miss it the first round. Around. Anyway. Yeah, I'm, I checked it good enough, I feel like. I don't think it's here. Wait. Sorry, I thought I saw something. Ooh, Celeste is here, which means there are stars in the sky, which means I could get Scorpio fragments, which means I could craft the uh, Scorpio lamp. Anyway, let's talk to her. Oh, good evening. Aren't the stars just exquisite tonight? Yeah, they are. Oh, too I almost forgot. I came across a recipe for an astronomical project and a book and dropped it down. I would like you to have it. Do let me know if you try building it, would you? Okay, so this isn't going to be any, um, themed item. It's just going to be a space-themed well, item. have a splendid rest of the night. I know I shall. What I mean is, it's not going to be a zodiac item. It's just going to be a 
Wait. Spaceship? A spaceship? Crude spaceship? Yeah, just gonna be normal space theme, but still. <gasps> Look at that! That is so interesting, right. Okay, I'm gonna do my daily chores, and then I'm gonna craft that. I wanna craft that, bad. Anyway, it looks like there are a lot of people crafting. I mean, there's a lot of people that could be crafting. We have option A, freckles, option B, diva, option C, goose, and option D, Clyde. You know what, let's bring back the magic eight ball for this. Okay, should I look in Goose's house first? M my reply is no. Okay. What about freckles? Um, cannot predict now. What about freckles? Ask again later. What about freckles? Should I go? My sources say no. Clyde? My sources say... Uh... Just, no. Okay, whatever, whatever, whatever. So, the... Ma oh, I, I accidentally picked this up. Sorry, anytime the eight ball is around, I get frustrated. Hmm. Anyway, so... Um... It's, it was that way, wasn't it? Anyway. Magic eight ball thinks it's diva. Said no to everyone else. Is the magic eight ball right? No! Come on! Oh, I like how you've decorated the place, though. Every celebrity these days have a, uh, slate pencil urchin underneath a horse mackerel. Now, that's totally normal for a celebrity. Anyway, Magic Cape was wrong, but it could still get it the second time. Clyde, is it Clyde? Yes. Just plain yes. That means it has to work. It's Clyde. Magic 8 Ball said so. It's wrong the last time, so could be wrong this time, but it is right. Okayish job, Magic 8 Ball. You get a pat on the head. Anyway. Check me out. I'm doing stuff. What are you doing? I'm making me an orange wall. Wow. <sighs> wow. I've never seen an orange wall before. One of the bugs on the floor whispered Must be really in cool. my ear while I was sleeping last night. So I gotta build it before I forget what it even is. What? You already yeah. know how to make an orange wall? But I've never seen one before. Can I look at yours? Sure do. That's real cool. You're always on top of things, and I'm usually stuck under them. I want to tell everybody okay, about just orange whatever, walls. Just whatever. down the recipe and then uh, put cookie Sorry. grease on so it deliberately. Really? So people would... Okay. Smell okay, so I'm I'm sorry. I'm I'm I'm, I'm I'm sorry. I was acting re weird about that. It's just I I was trying to make a joke about uh about this. He literally has an orange wall. Like last time a villager catch was crafting. Catch you later. Anyway, last time a villager was crafting an orange wall, it was also him, and I made a much better joke. I forgot what it was, but I made a better joke. I didn't mess up. Anyway, message bottle, message bottle, where are you? I must find you. Message bottle, you who? <whistles> message bottle. There he is. There's my boy. There's my message bottle. Anyway. Grass Sandy. I already know it. 
Whatever. Okay, I need to find who's here today. <gasps> Ooh! Star wishing! Yes! I must do it. I must get the Scorpio fragments. <gasps> right. I'll find my person, then I'll craft the spaceship, then... I'll look for the sea pig. <gasps> this ray... Oh, I'll get it. I'll get that Scorpio. Hey, King of Fawn! Seen Thank any special God. people around here? No, I haven't. But I'm pretty low to the ground. It's hard to see. Yeah. You're under the ground. Where's the special villager here today? Where are you? I see everything. But for some reason, I can't see you. Oh, look, there, that spaceship, right. I forgot about that one. But this one actually floats, it looks like. So the one I'm about to craft is much better. Much. That's a lot. Anyway, you know what? For now, I'm not going to look for the person. Oh, it's Sahara. Okay, there. Found the person. Hello. Now I can craft my spaceship. Good to be seeing you. It is good to be seeing you, you too. Want some flooring? No, thank you. Right now, I really, really, really need to, uh. Uh. Craft a spaceship. <laughs> Just your normal jack stuff. Craft a spaceship. Anyway, do I have enough iron nuggets? Yes, I do. Do I have enough star fragments? Yes, I do. Just enough, though. I could have sworn I had more star fragments. Only have ten? Are you kidding me? Oh, well. I could craft this, I'll be out of star fragments, but, 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 tomorrow I should get more, so I could still craft the, wait, how many does it require to craft this? Three. Yeah, I'm definitely, it doesn't really matter about the normal star fragments, because you can get those all year. What really matters is getting the Scorpio fragments. Anyway, I can still get this crude spaceship. Oh, and I don't want to put that in storage. I want to put the nuggets back in storage, though. And I want to put the spaceship in my beach. On my beach. Floating above my beach. But where? Yeah, my beach is very, very cluttered. How about I move my lawnmower somewhere else? Like, it's been mowing that patch of sand forever. I, there's other patches of sand that needs mowing, you know. Like right here, for example. So wait, how big is this thing? Is it big enough to go here? No, it looks like I'm going to have to move some DIYs that I've randomly just put on the floor for no reason. It's not big enough to go here, right? Am I just in the wrong position? There. Holy guacamole. That thing is cool. This lame palm tree is blocking it, though. Thing's so cool, though. Wait, I need a better place to put it. Like, I need it to be seen more. What if I, uh, took a, a, a coconut, 
ate it, then move the tree. Okay. Coconut, eat! I must eat the coconut! And then, flimsy shovel, use. I must use the flimsy shovel. Okay then, coconut tree, move! Oh, then I can move this other tree to the other side of the fountain and it'll be equal! And I can use that spot to mow more sand! No! It's in the wrong position! I placed it wrong! Oh! What a cruel world! Ah, whatever, I can just redo it. Taking so much time away from sea pig hunting. Never gonna find it at this rate. Okay. How about I dig a hole where I want it to go, and then just put it in the hole? There. And now, yeah, this looks so much better. The spaceship and all. Okay, I forgot to sell some stuff. So I'm gonna have to go over to the store, sell some stuff, and then we can finally look for that sea pig. Hear that? I mean, smell that? There was a pig scent in the air. <laughs> Smells like mud, sea mud. That's basically what they eat, uh, like, slop and mud. Like, decayed piece of, pieces of, uh, uh, like, ocean plants that fall to the floor. That's what they eat in real life. Okay, just make sure I'm not selling anything I want. No! No! You know what, let's talk to Peaches. I know I'm trying to save time, but Peaches is more important than time. I've been keeping my eye on a garden faucet. If I don't go for this now, I might just regret it later. Okay, you, you go for her then. You go, girl. Oh. Anyway. Let's put down a piece of seaweed. Because I like to put them on the floor. There. Let's drop some DIYs on the floor so I don't have to deal with them. Oh, I forgot to sell a muscle. Whatever. My muscles are shrinking. I could never, never forget that moment that Goose said I, my muscles were shrinking on Halloween. We and he expected that I would be shivering in my boots. I wasn't. Anyway, of course, another thing to stop me. A sturgeon. Great. What are you going to throw at me next? A tarantula? A sturgeon that is being very annoying. <laughs> oh, I love the annoying sturgeons. Oh, it's okay. Throw an annoying sturgeon at me, game. It's not like I'm trying to do anything. Okay, annoying sturgeon caught. I don't think it, this, this one can perform sturgery, though. Anyway, let's finally dip our feet in the water. Feetsies. Hello, hermit crab. Anyway, come on. Maybe this big build-up to diving into the water means I'm going to get the sea pig. It is the hardest diving creature that I've encountered yet. None other diving creature has been harder. Okay. 
Okay, this thing, what are you? A mantis shrimp? Okay. I'll fill you in on what the sea pig is. Wait, sorry, I get paranoid about my recording program working. Woo! It's working. Sorry, I just get, I just get paranoid about that anyway. I'll fill you in on the sea pig. It's really fast. It moves in U's. And, um, it is a medium size. So this is not moving at all. And it's large. So it's sea Ooh, I got a Nook Miles achievement for catching seaweed. Preposterous. Oh, it's for just catching sea creatures in general. Anyway, let's see if we can see our rocket ship from here. Oh, yes, we can. When clay is on my beach. I know, it's cool rocket ship. I'm glad I crafted it. Anyway. Too big, too slow, too sea cucumber. Well, sea pigs are a type of sea cucumber, so that's good. <gasps> Sky's thinking, wait, I gotta get to her fast so I can fix whatever she's thinking about. Come on, fast! There, I got to her. Is it true that you've been looking for a garden faucet? No, you're thinking of peaches. You're thinking of peaches. Oh, you, I always get you two confused. Huh? So, funny thing, I might have gone ahead and picked you up a garden you're thinking faucet. Of, you're thinking of peaches. Can we just call this a surprise gift? Yay, hooray, I have a million of them. Do whatever you want with it, okay? Wrap it up and give it to peaches if you want. I guess. But what I really want to do with it is, I don't know, just, for now, let's dive into the water again. Wait. Come on, I always mess that up. I want to do a front flip. I was able to do one in the last episode, why not this episode? Episode. Anyway. This is too big and too slow. Does move pretty fast, but sea pigs move faster. Anyway, there is a thing over there. Let's catch it. What are you? What are you supposed to be? A sea star? I say. Anyway. I smell pig. There's a pig close. Not this, but there's a pig close. There's a pig somewhere on the island. Next to the island. And I will find it. I shall find the sea pig. It's taking me... This is like the fifth episode that I've been looking for it. Crazy, huh? What are you? Seaweed. 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 <laughs> anyway, what are you? What type of creature are you? You're moving slow. Poo. It's a whelk. A whelk that looks like a shoe. Just kidding. It looks like a poo. Just kidding. 
It looks kind of like you. Anyway, sweet shrimp. Not what we're looking for. It's like two months ago we were looking for that thing. Well, what are you? You are another sweet shrimp. Anyway, what are you? What speed are you? You're a sea cucumber. Sea cuc. Anyway, what size are you in speed? Uh, another sea cuke. Or abalone. I was moving a little faster than a sea cuke. And you, you are. I'm guessing a Dungeness crab. Never mind. It's not a Dungeons Crab. Anyway, oh yeah. Uh, I've been doing a lot of episodes at light night lately. The reason is because the sea pig can only spawn after four, and uh, <laughs> for some reason a lot lately I've been booked after four for, for uh, in, like until now. For last lot of days. Anyway, Pearl. Cool. Those are pretty rare. And pretty pretty. Anyway, what is this? It is a mantis shrimp. Thought it was the sea pig for a second because those eyes are the same color as the sea pig. Listen to my button mashing. Listen to it. Whoa, what is that? It's a diving creature, but... I meant like it it got past me so easily. Yeah, I'm just overreacting. This thing isn't ain't fast. It's, just, it's, a, it's a sweet shrimp. Shrimp sweet. Shrimp meat sweet. Sweet shrimp. Shrimp sweet. Anyway, ooh, that thing over there has a lot of bubbles, but this thing, I don't want to not catch this either. I don't want to not catch anything, because just in case it happens to be a deformed sea pig. Anyway, I'm guessing this is a red king crab. I don't know why. Yep, it's a red king crab. I am so good. I don't know how I guessed that. I just did. And voila, it is a red king crab. Got stuck in the corner. Mister. Okay, red king crab. Cool. And this thing, it is, uh, I don't know what this is. I'm, might be a spiny lobster or, like it's moving in a really weird way. I don't know what it is going to be. Oh, it's a Dungeness Crab. I haven't really experienced a lot of them, so I wouldn't know. I think that's just my fourth. Anyway, and over here we have a spiny lobster. Three, three in a row, baby. Yep, three in a row. How oh, did I just get that lucky? Three rare creatures in a row. Ooh, skeleton! Out of 
bro, baby. Not out of bro, baby, but like I out of bro, baby. You know. I'm pretty sure he's not a baby. Anyway, hi, Pascal. Hey, man, about that scallop of yours. Can I have it? Sure. Here you go. Whoa! Thanks for your generosity, man. Since you were cool, I left you something you did. While I'm at it, let me lay some truth on you, the deep guy. Okay. Feel this. Ever tried to put a donut hole back into a donut? Man, one size does not fit all. Wrap your noodle around that. Yep, today is a good I don't have a noodle, day. and I... If I had a noodle, it wouldn't be long enough to... I already had noodle for lunch. Okay. Let's move on. Four in a row, baby? Maybe? Four rare things in a row? Well, mantis shrimp, that's rare. Semi-rare. So, four in a row. Can we keep the streak going? This impossible streak? Yeah, probably not with this thing. It's just gonna be a st yeah stupid star. Anyway, what are you? Or should I say, <gasps> what are those? It's an oyster. It's a night oyster. It's not even wearing any shoes. AKA Crocs. Crocs. Okay. What are you? Oops. <laughs> Sorry. I was doing it one-handed for a second. So I could be... L I don't know. So I could be efficient and do other things, too. Like, shine my teeth. Guess I could do that with my tongue. Okay, what are you? Something idiotic? A C in the meme on the me? Something that I will throw back? Anyway, before we go in, let's catch this little, little blue baby. Oh yeah, baby whelk. Anyway, what's the time? Yeah, I could make it to the store, sell some stuff, and then... Um, end the episode. And I'll make sure to remember to sell that muscle. Wouldn't want to forget, would I? Anyway, Peach is still looking at her garden faucet. Why won't she just go for it? Like, I think she was just pacing back and forth there. Anyway, let's make sure to remember. So the muscle. Boom, 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 boom. Oh yeah, Otterball gave me a pearl. Anyway. I want to save some of the rare things just in case, uh, um, just in case. Anyway, make sure I'm not selling anything I want. Yeah. And I want to save the seaweed because I like to put it on the floor. Anyway, I'm actually thinking that the snow crab is the rarest of the crabs for me. Because I'm pretty sure I've only ever caught two. Number two. 
Yeah, I think I only caught two. That is baby numbers compared to the four that I caught of uh, Red King Crabs and the other ones, Dungeness Crab. And an uncountable amount of Gazami Crabs. Anyway, let's end it next to my spaceship. You know what? I think I'm going to name the episode after the spaceship. Wait a second. I can actually burn you in the face. Ugh. Anyway, let's put some seaweed on my, on my beach. Because I like seaweed on my beach. How about we put one behind my sign? My self-portrait, you might call it. Or, never mind. You wouldn't have been able to see it anyway. Anyway, wait, what was I going to do? Oh, yeah. Spiny lobster. I, I can use a spiny lobster randomly here. <gasps> I know. So this uh, this uh, giant isobot has been playing against this bear forever. You know what? I think it needs a new competitor. Enter the spiny lobster. Wait, let's let's make it look good. There. Now it can play against the spiny lobster. And all oh, right, the teddy bear. You know what? You you can go next to here. Next to my pirate items. No, not the garden faucet. <laughs> oh, oh no. My baby bear, you can you can protect my pirate stuff for me. Baby bear is fierce. All right. How about we have a little mat here. Yeah, that's nice. Anyway, let's of course end it next to... Oh, that looks so good! Wait, okay. Let's uh, end it next to the spaceship. Um... Wait, let's look like... Let's look like... Let's, let's, let's like, play with perspectives. There. It looks like a really weird shot with perspectives. It makes it look big and... I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I guess you could play around with that with perspectives a little. Anyway, thank you for watching this episode. In the next episode, we will look for the sea pig once again. Sea pig is really getting on my nerves. Just kidding, like I said. Like, like I said a couple episodes ago, I want to have, like a challenge in this game. Like, none of the other creatures have given me a challenge. But anyway, thank you for watching this episode, and I'll see you next time. Good, good, goodbye, good, goofy goofballs. Hey, awesome viewers. Thank you for watching Jack's Junction. Please like and subscribe. It would really help the channel out. Keep being awesome. Yeah, I can't I can't think of anything with perspectives in this. Whatever.